George, first of all, Newcastle, a really tough pace to go in the best of times, but delayed kickoff, windy conditions, you must be really pleased with that result. Yeah, really pleased. Yeah, I think um, there, there was, uh, like you say, it's, it's really hard to go up there anyway and, and win games and um, a lot of teams struggle and, and I've certainly been up there plenty of times and, and come back on the wrong end of it. Um, and then, yeah, you throw in a little bit of adversity in the day, um, which isn't ideal, but I was really proud of the boys. I thought they really um, took control of the situation and, um, you know, so they were ready to go. And then I sort of told them, you know, calm down, there's another four hours and a bit more food and, and, you know, found a way to get as comfortable as we could and then got to the game and uh, I thought their heads were just on it and, and they delivered a really good performance on, on what was, uh, you know, a seriously windy day. Yeah, definitely. And we got the bonus point win as well, which looking at the league table now, how close it all is, bonus points could be crucial, couldn't they? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you know, you see the results this weekend. It, it, it's a bit cliche and everybody's saying it all the time, but anyone can beat anyone and it is just a relentless league and you've got to turn up every week and, um, you know, you've got to be really on it. So uh, it's, it's, we're only halfway through, really just over. So there's a long way to go in this league and there'll be lots of twists and turns, no doubt. But yeah, absolutely. You know, it's, um, it's one of those things you, you'd never take any game for granted. And we've got London Irish here at Kingshill on Friday night. It's a really short turnaround. What sort of challenges do they, does that sort of bring up? Yeah, London Irish are playing really well. You know, they, they score a lot of tries. They've got a really strong attacking game. Um, you know, their, their defence is very good. They're very physical. And, um, you know, they've got a lot of uh, international caps there. You know, they, they've got a star-studded squad. So uh, we're very aware of, of what's coming. You know, they, they played well against Exeter. And, um, yeah, I mean, we, we know it's going to be a massive challenge for us. Yeah, definitely. And we saw Gloss Rugby fans make the trip up to Newcastle. They were in full voice. This place on Friday night is going to be special, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, like, fair play to everyone who came to Newcastle because, you know, everyone would have made plans like us to be there for a three o'clock kickoff and, and everyone stuck around till seven. And uh, the noise they made was was brilliant. And, and it is every time we go away, it's, it's outstanding. I'm, I'm always impressed with the numbers who come and the enthusiasm. But um, obviously, you know, we, we get a, a, a hell of a lot more here at home and... Um, I'm sure those guys are always here as well and, and it's certainly, you know, it's such a great place to come to. The boys love it, you know, I love it, the coaches love it. I think everybody involved, you know, loves a home game here. Friday night is very, very special and, um, yeah, again, we, we always look forward to getting in and seeing a full crowd.